Here's how to use the two most powerful words in the English language to restore your sense of control over alcohol. I'm Colleen and I help high achieving professional women permanently reduce their alcohol consumption by 80% so they don't have to quit, even if they're drinking every day. How many times have you uttered the phrases, I can't control myself, my off switch is broken, I've always had a high tolerance, alcoholism runs in my family, I really worry about losing control. You have heard yourself say those words so many times, and the greatest downfall of human beings is that we tend to believe everything we think. But a belief is just a thought that you no longer question because you believe that it's true. You've basically memorized a bunch of statements and adopted them as your identity. But none of your thoughts are true. Thoughts are just words that float through your brain. Most of your thoughts are just ideas that you've heard and repeated. Your brain is basically a drunk parakeet. The only way to change how you drink is to change how you think. Thoughts are habits too. Now you already know that short of divine intervention, you can't just change all of your thinking habits at once, but you can change just a little bit every day. Where most people get it wrong is they try to change their behavior, but that's backwards. Over drinking is not the cause of your self-defeating thinking habits. It's the effect. You're not telling yourself the truth, you're creating it. The solution is to teach your parakeet some new ideas. Start with the mother of all power phrases, I choose. I choose to reject beliefs that do not serve me. I choose to stop telling myself that I am weak and incapable. I choose to trust myself, not to be perfect or get everything right, but to learn and to grow. I choose to ask for help when I need it. Acknowledging that you have a choice about what you believe is the first step. Change isn't easy, but not changing is way harder. There's hope, my friend. Follow, save, and go binge my page.